A local woman is behind bars tonight charged in a series of high-speed crashes in Buncombe County. Troopers say she was driving drunk when she smashed her car into a half dozen others. There were actually separate collisions that happened along I-40 West and I-26 East, ending near the airport road exit. News 13's Frank Crocker joins us live from there. Frank, who is the suspect? She is 27-year-old Tiffany Hill of Hendersonville, charged with DWI, hit and run, and reckless driving. Now, this was a wild ride that started just after 6 o'clock this evening, and it covered about 10 miles worth of interstate. Now, you can still see evidence of tire marks on the pavement where her car swerved and came into contact with all the other vehicles, a total of six. Hill's high-speed rampage finally came to an end when she slammed into a guardrail just short of Airport Road. One witness explained what it was like for so many drivers whose evening commute turned into a nightmare. It looks like this spot is where the mirror broke off. The tire actually rode up on the car and then she just kept going. And then I chased her the whole way uh, on 40. She hit several other cars where if, even if the car was in the other lane, she would directly come into them, hit the bumper, come back around and try to T-bone them and then kept going. Chris Rivers says he actually feels fortunate in a way that he was only sideswiped. He says when he looked up in his rearview mirror, he was certain that the car that was headed for him would slam right into his at a high rate of, rate of speed, but that did not happen. Tiffany Hill arrested at the scene. She, again, is at the Buncombe County Jail tonight. Once again, she suffered only minor injuries, is charged with DWI. No one else was injured in all of this. Reporting live in Buncombe County, Frank Crocker, News 13.